We are given that two of the three roots of the equation in the problem statement are equal and of opposite signs. Therefore, let's assume that the three roots of the equation are alpha minus alpha and beta. Therefore, x cube plus px square plus qx plus r can be expressed as x minus alpha times x plus alpha times x minus beta. Opening up the right hand side, we have x square minus alpha square multiplied by x minus beta, which is equal to x cube minus beta x square minus alpha square x plus alpha square beta. Now equating the coefficients of like terms across the left hand side and the right hand side, we have p is equal to minus beta, q is equal to minus alpha square and r is equal to alpha square beta. Taking the product of the first two equations, we have pq is equal to alpha square beta and note that this is equal to r per the third equation. Therefore, pq is equal to r, which is the desired result.